Nancy, you did it! Come on, Bess, let's get out of here. The plane's coming. George must have gotten the satellite phone to work. Both you guys are amazing. George! Hey, George! <laughs> Not only had George called the float plane company, but she'd contacted the U.S. Coast Guard and the police in Nassau, San Juan, Miami, and Havana. She even called the FBI, but they put her on hold. Anyway, while Bess and George waited for the authorities, I talked the float plane pilot into taking me up so we could search for Dwayne from the air. We soon spotted his boat about three miles from shore and radioed it in. But when they boarded the boat, the police found it empty. Was the boat just a decoy? Did Dwayne meet up with someone and make his getaway in a boat I wouldn't recognize? Or did he, while gloating over the map, accidentally fall overboard and drown? Unfortunately, it doesn't look like anyone will ever know for sure. I, of course, turned the treasure chest Bess and I found over to the authorities. But almost immediately, the Bahamian and Spanish governments were at loggerheads, arguing over which country had the legal right to claim the treasure as theirs. It soon became yet another mystery that may never be solved. As for the Gibsons, they'd been at a week-long family reunion in North Dakota and were mystified upon their return to find the resort overrun with police, government agents, and reporters. They didn't have a clue what had gone on in their absence. But they were happy about all the publicity Dwayne's escapade had generated and offered to let Bess, George, and me continue to stay on for a real free vacation. But we all said, no, thank you. The only thing that sounded good to any of us after what we'd just been through was good old boring home. Something sinister has been set loose at Waverly Academy. Someone, known only as the Black Cat, is terrorizing students, sending them strange notes, which are always followed by frightening accidents. The only way to unravel the mystery is to go undercover as a transfer student and enter the world of cliques and gossip that rules life at this exclusive all-girls boarding school. Help me uncover Waverly's centuries-old secrets and avoid becoming the Black Cat's next victim by joining me in my next adventure, Warnings at Waverly Academy.
take two. Speed. Action. <laughs> take 19. Speed. Action. Um... Hey, what the... Whoever glued my feet to this thing is in big trouble! What the heck? Oh, man. The monkeys must have... messed up the coin thing. You're supposed to take the coin, guys. If you'd read the script, you'd know that. Sometimes those monkeys can be so lazy.